Hey yo, in this video I'm going to show you exactly what I did to get this chaos game style. So this chaos game style has got every weapon unlocked, including concrete donkeys, sentry guns, faction strikes, and all the hidden weapons. You have unlimited of all of them. So I'm just going to load up the game real quick, and we'll see. I've got infinite alien production, bovine bits, all of these. I have infinite numbers of these, and I can use them as much as I want. So I'm going to show you how I do that. The um, So yeah, let's exit worms. All right. And all you need to do is use the save editor I wrote. Okay, you open up your save file. Alright, you go to schemes and... Oh, right. Right. Uh, I, haven't, I haven't added that to it yet. Um, okay, we'll show you another way, okay? Here, here's, here's another way. It's yes, cool. It doesn't use the save editor, but um, it will work. What you want, essentially want to do is um, find yokel.tweak and yokel XML inside your tweak folder, inside your worms4 folder. Just make a backup of this real quick. Okay, and now you'll open this up. And if you t search in here, it's the word standard, you will find the data for the standard game style. As you see here, um, it's ideas, yacht schemes, 59, and then all of these here are the IDs for the weapon settings data. Okay, and, and then down here is the actual weapon settings data itself. And you see here, ammo, negative one. And negative one means it's infinite, you know, create this create chance and the way is zero. So we want a game style of infinite everything, right? So here's what we need to do. Control F, replace, change this to regular expression. And now all I'm gonna do is just replace all instances of the word ammo to ammo minus one. Replace all. And now every single one in there is set to that. I'm not going to set the crate chance of everything to zero because there's no point if you already have everything. So just do the same, create dot style, I'll replace all, and very importantly, I'm going to set the turned away on everything to be zero as well. The way dot style, the way zero. Okay, cool. Now that's done, I'm going to save the game. I'm going to save this file. Alright. And that should be good. Now what we want to do is open up the game. And I'll go to multi, I'm going to go customize. And create a new game style. Base it off standard. Alright. And you'll see everything's already filled out as infinite. You can customize yourself you want. And then just call it whatever you want. Alright, now that's done, close the game, and then just change this file back. Oh, I needed to call that for a space at the end of the mission B. Okay, so now we should still have that game style even after we change it back because we made it based on that one. See? And so now what we can do is we can go multiplayer, deathmatch, select chaos, add some teams, stout. And now we have them from the concrete donkeys. That's all. That's just answer one commenter. Um, like I said, I am making a Worms for Mayhem save editor, which will make this a bit easier, but it's not done yet, <laughs> so, yeah, um, so yeah, that's it, thanks for watching, goodbye, transfer to